Hi, this is Josh Wright, Business Development Manager here at Art Main Auto Group in Jackson, Michigan. Uh, thank you so much for your interest in this 2018 Chevy Traverse LS. Uh, this vehicle has about 29,000 miles on it uh, and overall is in really great shape. The uh, reason I'm doing this video is we've had several people showing interest and I just you know wanted to do this video to point out anything I would want to know before considering uh, a pre-owned uh, SUV like this. So we're going to start off here in the front. Uh, this is a really nice metallic gray color, unfortunately. Uh, we have kind of a dreary day here in Jackson, so the video is probably not going to do it too much justice, but it is a really Really nice metallic color. Uh, front headlamps are in great shape. You're going to see the LED running lamps uh, that turn on during the daytime. You also have an HID headlamp there for at night. Front end is in great shape. You see that Chevy's got a nice chrome surround here on the grille. Nice big bow tie in the front and then they have kind of a, a black mesh to kind of uh, tie it all together so it's not too much but makes it really nice. I'm um, not seeing any significant stone chips, uh, you know, anything of that nature. Front end seems to be in great shape. Uh, the vehicle does have a uh, polished aluminum alloy wheel. This is an 18 inch aluminum alloy wheel. Uh, tread depth on the tires are good. So definitely nothing you'd have to worry about anytime soon. I'd like to kind of get an angle here on the side. Not seeing any door dents or uh, door dings or anything like that. Uh, moving on here to the passenger side in the interior. So it does have a black interior. Um, they've done some things like this. You can see the contrast stitching here on the door to kind of break it up. Uh, it's got a leather wrap dash. You can see that contrast stitching runs throughout. You have a glove box here. It does come with all the original GM manuals and such. Uh, so these are the seats. So it does have that same continuation of the contrast stitching. You also have uh, a gray cloth uh, insert here in the middle to kind of break up the black interior. Um, gives it a, a really nice refined look. This has the 233 configuration, which means you can fit two people in the front. Uh, three people in this bench seat here, and then you also can sit seat an additional three people there uh, In the rear bench seat as well. So a total of eight passengers can fit into this vehicle um, This is a split bench seat kind of hard to do one-handed, but you can actually fold these down flat They do move forward and back um, for additional leg room. So pretty versatile as far as that goes um, You have a couple of USB ports here as well as their own HVAC controls for heating and cooling Tread depth is about even on the rear tires as well as the front, so nothing to worry about there. See, so it does have the dual exhaust, backup camera, tailgate looks to be in good shape. So, these third row as well as the second row does fold on flat if you needed to use that for cargo. You also do have a small storage space down here for anything else that you may need. on to the passenger side of the vehicle not seeing any door dings or anything like that I mean overall aesthetically the vehicle is in great shape so moving on to the interior of the vehicle so it has passive entry basically what that means is if you have the key fob uh, you can press this button it'll lock or unlock no need to hit the key fob even it does have the ability to do that so as you can see, as long as you have this, it does offer remote start as well. Do you have power windows, power locks? Of course, everything pretty much has that nowadays. Uh, cruise control is located here. Uh, just push button start, so we'll just go ahead and press the brake, start it up. Um, it does, it is low on gas, no worry. If uh, you decide to purchase it, we'll make sure to fill it up, but it does have a low fuel light on it currently. Um, which you can see, it does have 30,264 miles on it. Um, this is the driver information center, so this will go through your tripometer, uh, vehicle information like oil life, your tire pressures, and things of that nature, and then of course your economy information. Uh, this does have a touchscreen radio, so it's AM, FM, um, XM radio it is OnStar capable. Um, this is also uh, Apple CarPlay as well as Android Auto capable, so if you're not familiar with that, definitely Google it, look at some of the stuff it offers. I mean, it has basically the same thing as onboard navigation. You can use things like Pandora radio, Stitcher radio, lots of technology in this radio. Um, even though it's not a fully loaded SUV, you can still appreciate some of those added benefits there. 
It does have automatic HVAC, so you just set this to whatever temperature that you like, just like a thermostat at home, it'll automatically heat or cool. Uh, in order to get that, it is also capable for the passenger to adjust theirs separately as well. Um, as you can see, there is a couple of USB ports, an auxiliary port, as well as another charging port as well. A little cubby hole there. Drive shifter. And then, of course, the center console, it still has that, uh, that contrast stitching running throughout as well. You do have some additional storage space here. Um, I will note, too, it's, it's definitely a, a non-smoker vehicle, so there are no weird smells or anything like that that you'd have to worry about. So, um, All in all, the vehicle is, is in great shape. So, um, As of right now, I, I, the vehicle is available. Um, if you're interested in scheduling an appointment or if you have any questions, feel free to reply to this email or give me a call directly. Again, this is Josh Wright, Business Development Manager here at ArtMain. My direct line here is 517-841-7689, 517 841-7689. It's Josh Wright. Have a great day. Thank you.